Very clever. Mm hmm Oops. Oh, and they've resigned. Okay, so that was a pretty neat game there, but pretty testy actually. Have a look at the analysis on that one. Okay, simple, simple opening. It's pretty straightforward. I wonder if it gives the name of the opening because I don't know the openings. What happened there? Okay. Do, do, do. Nope. I can't see it anywhere. Nope. So that's all pretty straightforward at the moment. And then the placement of their knight. The knight's capturing, but the pawn's going to be taken. So there's no support for the pawn. The queen is over the other side of the board. I'm thinking they're going to try and challenge this B pawn. So we grab the pawn. Nice position-ish. Nothing to write home about really, but it feels okay. So bringing the queen up and looking for the exchange. Well, not really. I was looking that they might forget that their queen is there and we'd be able to take their queen off the ball for free. So that's really why that happened. And then they're dancing with their knight again. So lack of development for their bishop and stuff. And the uh, the rooks really happy for that. Um, I thought I was trying to, not a sly one here. I thought, okay, protect here. Really, I wanted to still go for this knight. It's just that I wanted to block off the knight jumping to the center here. But didn't really need to worry about the knight jumping there anyway. Because he didn't actually move his knight to that position. Okay, so they moved, so now we're supporting the pawn with the rooks, and now we're just doing gentle supporting with the pawns. And just gravitating our pawns further up the board, just in case it gets to the end. So they're kind of giving up pawns a little bit. And not in major, you know, you can see why they've done the move. You know, the pawn's taken, but we do have two pieces on that pawn. We have the knight and the bishop on that pawn and we're welcoming the exchange on the open file with the rooks so we can take with the tempo win and yeah this was very clever yeah this was very clever because obviously if we take what happens back rank, back rank mate so it's very key to watch for those things even in higher level games you see this type of stuff so you have to be mindful of it because um, you feel like you're winning, you're like, oh yeah, 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 it's just giving a piece up for free, but no. So glad that we saw that little type of move and captured the pawn, and now we're trying to condense the bishop in. It's kind of trapping itself in a sense, in its own sense. So now we're attacking the bishop, and then they bring the bishop back. I mean, um, probably should have just taken because there was nowhere else for it to go. I mean, coming here, it's getting taken. Uh, going here it's getting taken going there it gets taken so maybe there was a further move maybe they had to resign themselves to the fact that this pawn was going and just get the bishop maybe operating here and doing some other safety work so that was a yeah interesting movement game 